A Kannapolis woman is searching for a worker who jumped into action to alert her that her home was on fire. Queen City News anchor Robin Kennedy tells us while the homeowner was away, someone else stepped in to get firefighters there very quickly. This is a story you'll only see on Queen City News. This is what Bobby Wilson couldn't see, but she was already picturing it. To get that call just sent me into a, um, you know, into a worst case scenario. Um, my heart sank. Um, I had to remember to breathe. Um, you know, all of my trauma training went out the window. The ER nurse was away from home and imagining how the flames might be destroying her house. It was pretty scary, so we ran from ran out of the store and I called 911, hightailed it back here. Bobby's porch is damaged. The siding is melted, but it's not as bad as it seemed when she first got that call. Most of the damage is on the outside of the home here. Bobby just can't imagine what might have happened if a mail truck delivery driver had not stopped by, saw the fire, and started talking to her through her ring doorbell camera. He was really just frantically trying to make me aware that my home was on fire. She doesn't know what the UPS driver did after that. She watched him on the ring get camera for a bit. He was gone by the time I got here. Yeah, so it was really kind of like one of those angel, angel things. He did more than enough. I'm thankful that I was on his route that day. Very thankful. Now she just wants to tell him. I'm thankful that his quick actions and quick thinking saved my home. Not only her home. I was very thankful that she wasn't here. I just, you know, this is my baby. <laughs> Bella the dog was out shopping with Bobby that day. Just one more reason to be thankful. In Kannapolis, Robin Kennedy, Queen City News.